your disease, and I'm the cure. Let me, let me say something. You saw what happened yesterday. All the talk about how my Build Back Better plan was going to increase inflation, going to cause these debts and all the like. What happened? Goldman Sachs and others said, if we don't pass Build Back Better, we're in trouble because it's going to grow the economy. And without it, we're not going to grow. And what happened? Stock prices went way down. It took a real dip. If you take a look, the va I wasn't, everybody thinks because I quoted 17 Nobel laureates saying this is going to help inflation. Think about it in terms of you're a hardworking person and you're making 60 grand if you're alone or if you're a mom or just on her own or if you're making 80 grand, mom and dad 90 grand like a lot of people do. And you're worried about inflation. You should be worried about it because it's a devastating thing for people who are working class and middle class folks. It really hurts. Where is most of the cost now? The cost is finding in gasoline, even though I put, even though I was able to bring it down 12 cents a gallon, will come down more, I believe. We talked about what the cost in food prices going up, et cetera. But look what's in, look, look what's in Build Back Better. Child care. You can reduce it by up to 70 percent. That'll be the difference between 20 million women who go on back in the worst force being able to go back if you pass it. We're talking about, we're talking about health care, insulin. You know, since we got, we got 200,000 kids with type 1 diabetes. You know what it's costing? It costs somewhere between 10 cents and $10 to come up with a formula, okay, a while ago, right? You know what it's costing on average? $560, $640 a month, up to $1,000 a month. What do you do if you're a mom and a dad working with minimum wage, busting your neck? You look at your kid, and you know if you don't get that vaccine for him, or that, excuse me, if you don't you get that drug for him, if you don't get that, 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 that be, be able to take that, Are you mental? what happens? The boy's going to go in a coma, maybe die. Not only do you put the kid's life at stake, you strip away all the dignity of a parent looking at their child. I'm not joking about this. Imagine being a parent. Looking at a child, and you can't afford. You have no house to borrow against. You have no savings. It's wrong. But all the things in that bill are going to reduce prices and cost for middle class and working class people. It's going to reduce their cost. What, what, what's inflation? Having to pay more than the money you have because things have gone up. Well, bring down all those costs across the board from child care to a child care tax credit. But I'm not supposed to be having this press conference right now. What you just said is one of the most insanely idiotic things I have ever heard. At no point in your rambling, incoherent response were you even close to anything that could be considered a rational thought. Everyone in this room is now dumber for having listened to it. I award you no points, and may God have mercy on your soul.